The Okanagan Science Center is currently hosting Dinosaurs in the Earth. It's uh, an exhibit that features animatronic dinosaurs, dinosaur fossils, interactive games and activities for children to, to play with, and just a lot of information on recent science around dinosaurs. As you go into our main gallery, we have a T-Rex head, which comes out. And then we also have a juvenile T-Rex, which is particularly interesting because um, a lot of the latest science uh, has revealed that dinosaurs are actually feathered. And so the, the, our juvenile T-Rex has feathers on them. Well, the visitor experience here, it, it's very much self-directed. Um, all the dinosaurs are on display, they're all out, so people can go around. Uh, spend as much time as they want with each dinosaur. For children, we have a dig table, so it gives them a chance to find their own fossils. We have another computer simulation where they can identify different dinosaurs in a, a more realistic dinosaur setting. Um, and of course, we also have staff here, so if people have questions, certainly ask us, call us over. We'll be glad to, to talk about a particular dinosaur or about the exhibit in general. So far, the feedback on Dinosaurs on Earth has been overwhelmingly positive. Um, people have just really enjoyed it. It's been fun to see um, visitors interacting with it. Certainly children, particularly. Uh, young kids are really liking it. It's just fun to see that, that look when they first get in and a dinosaur responds to and starts moving. Um, it's just it's a, it's sort of a, a delighted surprise. It's, it's just a really fun experience to watch. One thing that really makes this show special for this area is it has amazing production values. It's just really nice to see something that's this well done. This, the dinosaurs are so well made. The animatronics are very sophisticated. Um, I love watching the movements. It doesn't just do sort of angular movements. There's a lot of movements where heads will go in circles. So it's just, it, it's, it's a very well done exhibit and we're very excited to bring it to the Okanagan and give people in the Okanagan the chance to see it.